Before we start, I would want you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. Jake Paul took Mayweather's hat and made merch gotcha hat. Jake Paul stole Floyd Mayweather Jr.'s hat, which he was wearing, and later he announced at brand gotcha hat, and it was arguing with the Jack Paul and Floyd Mayweather. They both were like high voltage arguments as all the reporters were around. Jake Paul thought it might be an honest idea to mock the undefeated champion and still his hat mid conversation. Jack Paul disrespected the veteran boxer Floyd Mayweather. The clip began spreading like wildfire on the web, with people sharing memes on the incident. Not one to lose out on, an excellent business opportunity, Jake Paul has now announced a full gotcha merchandise line. After this, Jack Paul had pierced a tattoo with the gotcha hat on his leg, which is a meme getting popular on the internet. Whether Mayweather will comply with a fight, Jake Paul remains to be seen. It is considered before the fight that there is cruel behavior between the two. The YouTuber Jake Paul has launched a whole range of items available on his website to criticize the public and the boxing legend. He then launched with the various product hats, caps, hoodies, and also mug with various price ranges. The details are trucker hat, which has a price of $25, bucket hat price at $25, beanie price at $25, snapback price at $25, Dad hat price at $25, hoodie price at $45, champion hoodie price at $60, champion crew neck $60, t-shirt price at $25, sticker $7, mug price at $14. I stole this hat because he steals people's money with boring fights, gotcha hat, as stated by Jake Paul on May 6, 2021. After that, Mayweather was heard shouting an abusive language to Jake Paul. The drama resulted when Jake Paul stole the Mayweather's hat, which is eventually separated by their team members. A member of Mayweather did catch Jake Paul leaving, was seen dangerously and aggressively with anger, can be seen in his black eye. Jake Paul, instead of being under pressure, he thought to capitalize on the publicity he got from the argument. As well, he makes a tattoo of this incident on his leg and took this fight as an opportunity to launch a merchandise also. He changed his Twitter handle name to his new favorite face. Betting special, get Canelo to win at huge odds. Above that, Jake Paul was loving each moment, which is what's created to get himself famous and enter the controversy. Jake Paul leaves no moment to make himself famous through the viral things he normally does on his YouTube channel to get higher views. The YouTuber grabbed a pound for pound legend's hat and attempted to run away with it before being briefly choked by the other boxer, because the brawl broke out. Punches were thrown amidst the mayhem, with Paul later spotting a black eye during a social media post. The YouTube superstar showed off his new ink Thursday night, just hours after he was roughed up at Hard Rock Stadium by Floyd and therefore the boxer's bodyguards. And it's pretty damn funny, the tat, located slightly below his right knee, reads gotcha hat, and features an image of a jockey cap. The scene was wild, Jay got plummeted after stealing the cap, and showed off a shiner and bloody mouth during a video of the aftermath. Paul has no interest in his brother's upcoming boxing match with Mayweather, the YouTube sensation still took full advantage of his crap with money. No, but 24 hours far away from his hat grab, heard round the world, Paul sat right down to get some fresh ink. In addition to his new tattoo, Paul launched a replacement merchandise line with an equivalent slogan. It's quite the thought, and one that ought, to only increase Paul's growing brand. Hate him or love him, this is often a fantastic business move by Paul. His brawl with Mayweather was the talk about the town yesterday, more so than the particular news conference that preceded it. Paul should be ready to utilize his publicity to even make more buzz around his next trip to the prize ring which can find yourself happening against Mayweather after Logan catches his licks next month. Jake tweeted, Word on the road, already is that Floyd is sending goons after me to undertake or kill me or hurt me if I die. He felt so strongly about that hat debacle that he got a tattoo of gotcha hat on his thigh with a picture of a hat below it. That's all for today, I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you never miss any amazing video from us.